Everyone loves a rodeo, and Jill Hayward is here to discuss the North Thompson Fall Fair and Rodeo with us. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you very much. This Good is a fantastic tradition. So many people look forward to it. Uh, tell us a little bit about your involvement with the fair and rodeo. Oh, gosh. I've been involved probably for about 30 some odd years now. The rodeo's been going since 1949, so it's, uh, it's part of, uh, I guess everybody's part of the rodeo family now. Yeah. And the Fall Fair family. But you're the um, expert at this point. That well, many years. I'm just the boss. <laughs> <laughs> just. <laughs> I'm the president, so that's it. Buck stops with me, but we are we have just a tremendous crew and a huge team of people that come out yeah. and make sure that it all happens on the weekend. And um, they just, they you don't see them all year, and mm -hmm. then about a week before the fair, they come out, yeah, sure and that. it just all starts to go together, and they're fantastic. just masters. They're like their own maestro. They're just amazing. Nothing the like this can happen together. without great volunteers. That's right, yeah, and we so really great. are so fortunate that awesome. we have some wonderful people, and we've got... We are having a rodeo in a fall fair. Contrary to some of the rumors that mm. are going around that we've canceled, we never even thought about canceling. Okay, so, so that's great information. Yeah, it's, it's very great important. To get out there. The, yeah. the fall fair and rodeo is going ahead. It's you definitely going it. ahead. It's going to be the same fall fair and rodeo, probably bigger and better than it has been in the past. Excellent. We're going to have a lot of support. We've had a lot of evacuated animals at the mm -hmm. fairgrounds, mm -hmm. and people I think have maybe been concerned that because of all those animals, we're not going to have okay. the event. A lot of them have gone home. We will still have some there mm -hmm. but, but we have 27 acres so we have lots of places Perfect. to find for them and uh, they're going to find out what a fall fair is all about yeah. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, new guests. That's, that's right. The more the that's merrier. right. Yeah. What are the dates for this year's event? Uh, second, third and fourth of September so okay. it's a Labor Day weekend, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Excellent. Saturday is the big parade, uh, goes right down up the center of barrier and anybody who'd like to participate please do, it's free, there's no charge. And our rodeo starts at 1.30 every day. We have a BCRA rodeo all three days. Saturday night is our big cabaret dance. Mm -hmm. um, pardon me, Friday night I missed. Friday night kind of kicks us off with a family dance, non-alcohol, so that the kids can come with mom and dad. Perfect. And Sunday night we have a cowboy concert. And Monday is our family day, and we have a children's Fun. parade, family parade. And uh, so we have a full weekend. Um, we've just got... The sights, the sounds, the smells of the fair, it's and the place to be. it is going yeah, to be the place like to be. It. I think we have yep. a few pictures actually from oh, super. previous That's years to That's take great. a look at yeah. as well. If you haven't oh, had a chance, go. yeah. you're going to want to come to this. Tell us a little yeah. bit about what we're looking at. Well, here. we're looking at the steer riding and some young person who's mm -hmm. just cleared the cleared the way, <laughs> and it looks like he probably made his eight second ride. And and we have uh, right from the steers right to the bulls. And we have uh, lots of heavy horse competitions. This, this is, is one a, of my this favorite This is a multiple parts. hitch competition, but on Saturday and Sunday night, they also do the heavy horse pull. And it's amazing how much they pull. And then, of course, Let twice a day go. in the afternoon when the rodeo is on mm -hmm. is the pony chariot and chuck wagon racing, which is the only one, I think, still in existence wow. at a fair in British Columbia. So it's so a pretty major highlight. It's very major, Don't yeah. It's a super that. thing. So, And aside from all of that, we have lots of activities for the kids. We have a magician on site, a clown. Uh, we have the Laughing Loggers show um, that goes three times a day every day. They are absolutely it's hilarious. Very popular. It's yeah. very popular. Um, they've got their own following. Um, we have uh, lots of exhibits in the exhibit hall. We have food vendors, and of course, fair food is tremendous because okay. you can. If you go for three days, you got to figure out how you're going to fit all those concessions <laughs> into all yeah, of your meal times. Safe, safe, safe. That's right. And yes. on top of it all, you have some giveaways that we're going to do today. We have some giveaways. I'm quite excited. I have two envelopes here. In each envelope, there are two VIP seating tickets, mm -hmm. and the VIP seating is up in the crow's nest and the viewing area at the end of the rodeo arena. So you're up there, be able to so see the whole cool. rodeo arena. And then also with that is two tickets to the cabaret dance on Saturday okay. night. So you it's are a great, generously giving great those away. Day. We are. They're $140 package in Amazing. each, and we're giving away two of them. Okay, so if you would like those tickets, and I'm sure that you would, you can email us at midday at cfjctv.com. Thank you so much. This is going to be a blast. Thank and I'm you. sure it will it's be great. bigger and better than ever. Thanks for hearing from us, and everybody come on it's down to the fair. Great to have you on. We'll be back with more midday in just a moment.